So we're going to get donuts and we're going to a bar. Of course. And we are going to get sushi. Favorite food ever. But there's no dairy, no alcohol, and no fish. adventure is actually inspired by our own personal styles um, like 95% of my wardrobe is all black and Owen is very <laughs> colorful likes patterns so it's kind of like things that you wouldn't expect that go together but go together well so we are going to three different places today to check out and yeah come join us let's see what we find excited. First stop of the day, Dough Donuts. Um, it may sound like a simple donut shop, but they have a lot of really cool combinations and flavors uh, that you wouldn't really think of. So let's go in and try and check it out. Donuts has lots of unique and amazing flavors like cafe au lait, lemon poppy seed, and cheesecake. But the main reason we came was for their vegan donuts that are to die for. My favorite is the vegan hibiscus, which is absolutely delicious. I promise you, three dates on a single weekday is not our normal Tuesday down in New York City. I promise you. No, it's definitely not. I actually had a doctor's appointment in the city, and so that's why we headed down there. And that's how we make quality time and our adventures work, is we plan around our busy schedules. Yeah, very true. Uh, since she had a doctor's appointment, I actually decided to take a day of leave off of work so that way I could join her down in the city. Yeah, and so we made reservations for that night so that we could go to dinner. And then we planned on hitting the sober bar before and also hitting the donut shop. But what you don't see is that I was almost late for my doctor's appointment. I had to jump in an Uber and head across town. And then my doctor's appointment took way longer than expected. And so we got less time at the sober bar because we had reservations we had to get to later. So let's go see what we saw. See if we made it. stop was a sober bar where we only had time to grab one drink since we had dinner reservations later that evening. As you can see, they had plenty of alcohol-free selections and a great atmosphere. The drinks were amazing and I wish we had more time before running off to dinner. So our third stop of the evening is a 15 course vegan restaurant. Omakase is a style of dining where the chef chooses your food for you. The chef prepared 15 courses that were all vegan, serving us items we would have never got on our own. We were definitely not disappointed and left full and happy.
Next one is a Torts Baby Japanese Eggplant with a di grated diamond radish and scallions on top. Our next one is the Citrus Cucumber with a Japanese Ume Plum. Special shout out to Dough Donuts, Hecate, and Omakasa Seed. If you'd like to check them out, their links are below in the description. And let us know below if you would have tried any of the things we went to today.